Sagittarius, welcome to the channel, guys. My name is Nali, aka Owl Tarot, and I'm here to give you guys your weekly reading. We're going to tap into this energy, see what's going on with you guys, what is coming towards you this week, your overall messages, intentions, and outcomes. But before we get started, guys, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. It allows me to connect with you energetically, and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. As you all know, my readings are timeless, general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. If the reading resonated and you would like additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The information is in the description box below. And as always, I want to thank each and every one of you for all your love and support. It is truly appreciated. Guys, don't forget to check out your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs for additional messages and clarity regarding this reading. So we're going to go ahead and get started here. I went ahead and I pulled out the first set of oracles for your reading. And then we're going to pull out more messages in a bit. The first card that flew out was release control, my Sagittarius. It is time to let go of something. It is time to release the control. Unfortunately, not everything in our life is meant to be controlled by us. And it's time to let something go here. Work through your feelings. Okay, work through your feelings. All right. There's something that I feel that like you've been holding on to. Okay, you've been holding on to something, maybe some resentment, some anger, but that's holding you back. It really is holding you back because reflect your priorities because you're holding on to this past situation because you're not letting go of those feelings. It is, they, they are, spirit is asking you to reflect on your priorities. Like, what is your priority here for you, Sagittarius? Is it you focusing on this? inner demon or is it you focusing on you it's time for you to let go of things that just don't serve a purpose in your life not everything in our world is meant to be controlled by us and this is what i'm really getting here sagittarius is that for some of you guys this may even have to do with a relationship a marriage that you've been trying not to necessarily control but keep together okay you've been working so hard to make sure your person is happy that they don't walk away that they don't leave that they let it go. Let it go. Because at the end of the day, if this person is meant for you, guess what? They're going to stay with you. If that person was meant for you, guess what? They'll come back to you. Okay? So you must release control. Leave it in God's hands. Whatever is meant for you will come back to you in divine timing. In divine timing. And work through your feelings. It's time for you to start healing yourself. It is time for you to really start focusing on you and trying to get your emotional part of your world under control. Okay, that's what you need to control is the emotions. Okay, that's what you need to work on is your healing factor. And with reflect on priorities, you need to be prioritizing on yourself. Only you and no one else but you. I know some of us are parents. I'm a parent. My, As a matter of fact, today is my oldest son's birthday. He's 27. So I will always baby my babies. But there's times where I just ignore my babies. It's all about me. It's all about me. And that's what you need to start doing is that you need to start giving yourself all about me time. Maybe an hour at the gym or just sit in the, on the toilet for an hour. It don't matter. Just give yourself your time. You got to start prioritizing yourself first. You got to start putting yourself first before you put anyone else. You've been trying to control a situation that necessarily could have already been over and you've been trying your hardest to try to keep it under control and it's just not working out. It's time for you to let it go because if it is meant for you, it will come back to you. Okay? Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. What are the overall messages here for my Sagittarius, please? Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. Ah, oh, communicate, receive, and express the truth. It's time to sit down and have a conversation, okay? It's time to receive the information that this person is trying to communicate, and it's time for you to communicate and express your true feelings to this person. There's a truth that needs to come out, okay? There's a conversation that needs to be had. Maybe by having this conversation here, Sagittarius, you'll be able to release that control. You'll finally be able to get that truth and that clarity that you so long desire, and you'll be able to move on. But you're afraid. Fear. You're expecting the worst, afraid of failure, wasting time on negative thoughts. You, you're afraid. You may be afraid of opening up and telling this person what you truly feel or what's really going on. You're being told to, to, to let your true feelings out. Express yourself. Be transparent. This is going to be that one time in your lifetime where you can finally just open up and nobody's going to say anything to you. It's going to be time for you to let go of all that holds you hostage. 
all that holds you back from happiness, it is time to let it go. Because you've got abundance. Abundance. An inflow of money, love, and rewards. You may be trying to control the wrong situation. You may be trying to keep the wrong marriage, wrong relationship intact. Mind you, you have something better waiting for you on the other side. Very near, in the very near future, there may be another beautiful relationship that's going to come into your life. That's going to make you 10 times happier than what you're dealing with right now. For some of you guys, you're really trying to hold on to this job because you're afraid. What if I lose my job? I got to feed my family. I got the mortgage. I got... It's time for you to walk away. If these people are mistreating you, if they're not paying you the way they should, if you're not getting the rewards that you should be getting, you need to walk, you need to move on, move forward. Get that resume out there because there is abundance in your very near future. There's abundance. This is a take a leap a leap of faith energy. Okay, it's time for you to take a leap of faith. Stop trying to control a situation and start moving forward. It is time to talk. It is time to get some truth out there, and it is time to release that fear. Release the control and release the fear. Final message here, universe. Leap of faith. Wow. Didn't I just say that? This is one of those leap of faith readings. Take that risk. Take that risk. Walk into your boss's office and be like, guess what? I need so-and-so money. If not, I'm going to another company. I'm looking at 111 right now. Um, tell your person, I need so-and-so attention. If not... I think we should separate. Whatever it is that you are trying to bring into your life, you need to take this leap of faith already. Speak up, communicate, let those know what you want. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians, what are the overall messages here for my Sagittarius, please? Overall messages for Sagittarius, please. Ace of Pentacles. I told you, you have abundance coming towards you. You have a beautiful new beginning. Okay, a very stable new beginning. Take that leap of faith, please. Open up, speak your truth. Tell people what you really want. Tell your employer that you need a raise. Tell your person that they need to pay attention to you. Whatever it is that you need to do, you need to speak up already, okay? Because what, what is awaiting for you, again, is abundance. This is double confirmation. By taking that leap of faith, by opening up, by giving up on that control factor, you're about to open up the doors to a beautiful, stable new beginning. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians, what are the overall messages here for my Sagittarius, please? Chariot, victory, and success. This is crazy, Sagittarius. I just love it. I just love it. The second you release control is the second you call all this abundance in. The second you stop to try to control a situation and you no longer put your energy in something where it doesn't belong, you start opening up the, the doors to success, abundance, new beginnings, communications, leaps of faith. It's like everything around you just automatically starts changing. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. Fool, please, oh my gosh, please take this leap of faith. Please, please take this leap of faith. This is double confirmation. Double confirmation. For those of you that this has to do with a job, take that leap of faith. Okay, walk into your boss's office. Tell them what you expect to get paid. Believe you or not, you're going to give that, that money that you want. Ace of Pentacles, abundance. Leap of faith, the fool. It is time for you to start opening up. It is time for you expressing. Stop controlling things that no longer serve a purpose in your life and start controlling those that do. It is time for you to speak up for yourself because you're about to bring in all this abundance and happiness. It's just waiting for you. It's just waiting for you to claim it. So speak up. It's time to move on and move forward. All right, guys. I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if you would like to book a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye.